up everybody it's your boy tbuja23 and we back with a new video and we hopped on some roblox i've actually been playing this game for about two days it's been about two days uh off and on just because i also play other games like call of duty 2k etc all that stuff um but this is a brand new game to roblox it's only been out for a couple of weeks and my buddy showed me and yeah it's super dope if you guys remember the game farmville you know, Farmville from Facebook back in the day. You know, y'all gonna be calling me Boomer for this, but like, it's it's old, right? Farmville's old. Somebody told me the other day it was on the phone. It was never on the phone when I was playing. I mean, I remember on my little notebook laptop, like laptop I had back then, and it was just, you know, Farmville all day, every day, man. Farmville was life. That game was so fun when it came out. It was one of my favorite games on the computer. But now they have this thing called Farmlands on Roblox. And by the way, let's try to smash the like goal today. The like goal is going to be. 40 likes, man. Let's, you know, help me out. Let's smash that like goal. Let's see if we can do it on this video. And then we'll see what we'll do with the next one. But also, comment down below the keyword of the day is going to be Farmville. I just want to see Farmville. It's Farmville. F A R M V I L L E. Let's get it, man. But let's go on to with today. I'm going to be just playing the game, showing you guys a little playthrough and explaining on how you guys can play the game. Yeah, I got a lot of money, as you guys can tell. And you guys can have up to three different save slots, which is very cool. So, if, you know, you've already done everything, but you want to restart. Um, you know, you can definitely restart. Get a fresh start to it. We'll go with, let's go with number six. I like how you can choose your area where you want to be. Whoa, 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 whoa. Y'all say, whoa, let's not look real quick. Ooh, we shine in here. I've been playing, like I said, I've been playing this. My money's at 133 million. Uh, top one lobby, damn, we've already got people coming over to see. It's, it's that quick, man. My place is like, nah. I don't know if y'all know, but if you, this game, I'm going to tell you right now, it desperately needs, I know it's new, but it desperately needs vehicles. I, I, I actually went on the Discord and, you know, sent it out to the developers. It really needs uh, vehicles. I think having tractors on this game would be one of the coolest features to it. It would definitely make a lot more people play, in my opinion. If you had a tractor that could do the plowing for you, you had to drive it though. If you had a tractor, you drive, you know, you, you sit there and you put the seeds in and you sit, you, you know, you, you crop everything and do it all with a tractor. That would be something super dope. Like start off, yes, with hands because everything right now is with hands, right? I got to do, I got to get the till, get the water. Now I have the max things in the game. And right now this B button doesn't work just so if the developers do end up seeing this on Xbox, the B button does not work to get rid of your, uh, your water can, your tools, or whatever you're using, just so you guys do know. Um, but they have building on this, they have everything, and I also want you guys to just please watch the entire video. If you do not enjoy Roblox, you're not a fan of Roblox, or you're just not a fan of this farm game, from what I'm showing you so far, then don't click off the video. Put on mute and watch another video. Just let this play out, help me get my watch time up there. I really appreciate it. But let's go on, man. So this is my farm. This is what we got going so far. Now, I planted these. I'm going to have the entire fields filled with these. I can collect them. I'll show you guys with the best one. This is actually probably one of the better, um, you know, fruits or plants, I guess, as you can call it, to plant in the game. They cost twenty-five thousand a piece to plant, and they give you a pretty good profit. Now, if you guys want me to do an entire video breaking down how to build up yourself and get money real quick, I said this took no more than two days. And the only game pass in this game that I do have is the extended backpack, and I got it the second day. I like I got it just the other day. It wasn't like I got this the first day. It really doesn't give you a crazy, like, it doesn't help you out to be better than somebody. It just kind of saves the annoyance of having to empty your bag earlier. In a way, that's all it is. It's really save time. But it doesn't, like, I'm not buying any, like, game pass. Like, VIP gives you double coins. I don't want to cheat. I told my buddies I would earn away. Yes, it does turn to nighttime. It's probably going to start raining soon. There it is. There's the rain. And a little tip to you guys. When it's raining, your crops actually grow faster. Now, the stupid thing that I find is the rain doesn't water your plants. Now, I'm going to show you guys. That, uh, we're going to do a walkthrough real quick. Then I will come over and we're going to plant some plants. Now, this is what you need to use. I got the best one in the game that doesn't cost Robux. But this is just how my fields are looking. These ones are empty because I want to get to a point where I'm going to fill them. I have enough to obviously fill them with these, but I want to do it with you know, the best of the best. Now, this is my barn. I haven't done any paint to it because the paint wheel is, it doesn't work on Xbox right now. I know it's a new game. But when you go to build, this is what the paint wheel looks like. Uh, like, if I click that, I can't sit there and move my D-pad with that. So, changing the color of something is just not going to work. 
Um, that's just how it is, I guess. But that's all right. You know, that, well, you do what you can. Um, but this the barn. I have not put any animals in them. To be honest, they died the first time I put them in. I didn't. I'm not too entirely sure on it. And the only way you can have these doors is if one is off center. And another thing the devs need to put work into. Now, like I said, it is a new game, so you know I'm definitely gonna let them have a lot of slack on it because these are new to developing games, especially a game that's like this big. This game already has over a million plays. It's blown up. It's doing huge. Now these little green ones. I only use one needed on a corner or something. They cost 25,000 for those and 100k for the gold ones. The gold ones cover a way bigger area and these are what water my plants. That's what they do. Uh, I don't know what bugs. And I'm not doing the run thing. Sometimes there's a, a bug in the game where you can't plant your plant. It's just how it is. But we'll go through real quick. These are all the plants. So we go through. And yes, 50 million is the last one. And basically what it looks like is a sunflower. You know, that's all it really looks like. It's just a sunflower with a halo on the top of it. We'll plant ones just so you guys can see. Um, but I'm not going to go through planting all of them. I will do that in a video. Comment down below if you want me to do a, a video explaining, like I said, a tutorial on how to really build up your place and how to technically just build. You know, building is a big feature to the game, being able to build a barn, build my house here. Now, it is not painted. That's why the wood's a little bit of a different color than some of the part of the roof because of stairs. Now, my doors are also off center because I didn't want it to be popping out of the wall or anything to look stupid. So, these are all the plants. These are, uh, so you can buy eggs. They give you a chance to hire a rated animal. Or you can just buy the animal straight up yourself. Now, I'm probably going to buy $25 million one. And, uh, or like, I can make a zombie farm, snow cloud, you know. It's kind of dope, man. The little pets and stuff, they, they add to the game that they're... They're a different feature. Now this new thing doesn't work. Um, now these are what you can do. Walls, floors, stairs. Now the stairs are that big. That's one stair in front of me that you guys can see. Same with the roof. That's one stair. So they are big. There's no like short stairs. That's why my deck is so high. Or, or porch, whatever you want to call it. Uh, you got the windows, fences, and doors. Now the furniture is just bed. That's all it is. I don't know why that's all it is. But you're able to fish, water, Tiller is for digging up the dirt, you get your axe, all that stuff. Cutting down trees, not a cutting down trees to get you money, but nowhere near as much as planting. Obviously, it's a farm game. That's just a little feature. You get bored of the other thing. Fishing the same way. I have the best rod in the game that you can possible without paying Robux. And yeah, you don't get nearly as much money as I do planting these plants. Yeah, I get a way ton more, like a lot more. Now, another cool thing here is the little purple shop thing. This is something I find very dope, very dope. Now, you could upgrade your tools here, and you can expand your plot. So I have all the plots. All together, there are nine plots, and you get to start with one. So you have to upgrade eight of them. Now, the front two plots, down where my barn is, the front two, that whole row cost five grand a piece. The second one's a 10 grand a piece, and these last three back where my house is, are 70,000 a piece so it's not too bad it's actually priced pretty well uh, and then they have this cool feature which is daily deals um, daily deals so what is every 24 hours or 12 hours whatever it is they have this shop where you can come in and get stuff for a cheaper deal that's already in the game so I can go buy this rainbow egg regularly for 60k but because it got put in this shop I can get it for 50k same with the modern stairs I get it for 230 instead of 300 which helps with people starting out some of the pet, it's an easy way to get a pet cheap. And those melons are actually, that's an insane deal for somebody who needs those melons. Those frost melons are very, very useful. Now that's where my house is. Now this is a carpet on the ground. It looks like a dirt road. There's the best use for it possible. There's no other way I would have used it. Wood, I'm probably gonna change up these panels at the bottom. Maybe uh, extend the railing out here. Um, but this is what my house is looking like, nothing crazy. I like how the UIs, they all are actually very well, they work very well. You know, just a couple rooms, nothing in them because there's not really any furniture. Like, this is about as much furniture as I get. There's a bed, there's no like kitchen furniture, nothing. You know, we got the attic and everything. Um, weirdly, the windows don't go through, they kind of place on top of the wall. Which I'm not sure why they wouldn't make a real one, see how it pops out. So I don't know what it is, the whole deal with it. I also added this part to the roof where you know my rails pop out. 
something nice, something you know, to add to like a farm style type of place. But we're gonna go and show you guys the 50 million dollar plant, which is the last plant in the game. We're gonna come over here. We're gonna plant it by the water thing, so I do not have to water it myself. So I'll plant a couple. We'll plant three of the most expensive ones. Sound good to me? Sound good to you? Let's get it. Make sure you do smash the like button, subscribe if you're new, click that bell to get notified. We have the road to 1K subscribers, man. We get closer every day. So we're gonna buy one of these. Boom. That's the 50 million one. We're gonna buy the 5 million one. Boom. And we're gonna buy the 1 million dollar one, and we're gonna compare the prices just so you guys can see. And then, like I said, in the next video of this farm game, I will do an entirely new like review of it just so you guys can kind of get how to expand yourself now you see 50 million you still have 77 million doing really well we're obviously gonna make a profit off of this now you'll also see which one takes the longest so far the five million dollar one is popping up faster than the 50 million dollar one and the one million dollar one now these ones are kind of at the same speed because I did place this one last that's the sunflower starting to grow but you guys can tell how much longer it takes now the reason why I'm saying to pay attention to the length is even though this one may get you more money this one I'm already able to collect and this one I'm able to collect already the thing watered them and this 50 million dollar one I could already have two of the five million dollar ones done maybe ten of them whatever for like the equivalent of one of these so that that's why the most expensive isn't always the best. In my opinion, so far, I'm gonna explain, is that the Hellfire Ferns are the absolute best ones. Now, all I'm saying so far, but that is in my opinion. So we're gonna go through, and we're gonna compare these three. They're the top three most expensive ones in the game. Looks super cool, by the way. So this one, which costs one million, it gives me a profit of 28,000. Now it's not bad for the speed. So we go to this one, it costs five million. It gives me a profit of 250,000 for each one. So every 5 million I put underground is gonna give me 250K. Amazing. This one gives me a profit of 700,000. That's insane. That's the highest profit you'll get off of a plant. Now the reason why I think it's not the best is because 200, I get 250K for double the amount of speed. So technically I could plant three by the time this one's done. And get over a million for the five million dollar one so this one actually isn't the best the only reason i will plant these is in the end i would like to have an entire farm of the 50 million dollar ones do you not know how crazy that would look having a farm and every single one of these blocks is worth 50 million that's crazy so that's the goal is we're gonna eventually have each patch right now the front ones are just the uh the ghost peppers They're really dope they actually this is probably the best one to get you the most money but I, i'm talking too much that's just it for the video, man. We're, you know, we're grinding this game. We got a lot coming, a lot of cool games I'm trying to bring to the channel. I know people ask for Brawlhalla. I'm going to get some buddies on Brawlhalla. A lot of guys that I used to play Brawlhalla with don't have live right now or just don't have access to it. So that's why I haven't brought it to the game yet. But we will be bringing that soon. If you do, smash the like button, comment, you know, the keyword. Put down Farmville down below, Farmlands, whatever you want to do with the game, but put Farm something in the comments. I really appreciate it. Always join up and come check out the farm with me, play the game with me. You know, send me a message. I reply to all of them. Unless they have to do it with RBA, I'm not replying anymore. Um, but that's it, man. Subscribe to the channel. We're on the road to 1K. It's your boy, Chipper23. And I don't know, man. Y'all have a good day, man. Peace.